Good morning, everyone. Ali is listening to Christmas songs in the shower at the moment. We are both a little bit hungover today, um, quite a lot hungover today, actually. Don't think we got up until 10 o'clock, which I absolutely hate, but even though we had a nap yesterday, apparently we needed more sleep. Oh my gosh, there's such big birds in the garden. Look. It's very windy outside, but we are getting ready to go for a walk now. There's a lot of flooding around and we want to go and like see the flooding basically and just have a little look around and just have a walk. So Ali's in the shower. He's already worked out today. I have not because I have not worked out in a very, very long time, but we're going to get some comfy clothes on. I don't think I'm going to do makeup today. Probably just some something to brighten me up a little bit, but I've got lots of nice nourishing oils on. I've got Esper Spa replenish oil on my face and restorative oil on my body. Feeling very, mm. and Ali was like, oh, you smell good. I was like, thanks. I'm gonna put some warm clothes on and we're gonna head out. Basically today is like an admin day at home and we are doing lots of prep for Christmas, presents, shopping, all of that kind of stuff. So yeah. And also it's our wedding anniversary in two days time or a few days time and Ali and Carrie have been trans transpiring? No, not transpiring. Conspiring together for my like gifts or something. And I think I know what some of them are, but apparently we're going away somewhere and I don't know where we're going. So it's all a surprise. They're not telling me anything and I'm really frustrated. I've been trying to guess. And like, also Ali, Ali knows me well that I don't really like going away unless I really have to. So, but hopefully I'm gonna find out as to why because Carrie says I'm gonna love it. So anyway, I need to get some moisturizer or some lip balm on my lips and I need to get dressed and out of my dressing gown. Don't know if you remember watching on my stories if you follow me on Instagram, the time that Lumi got into the basket and then fell to the bottom because she thought that it was strong enough to hold her. We've now gone around the house and um, secured the baskets with like cushions and blankets inside them so that she's got a little bed in them because she just loves these baskets so much. There's one in my office that she spends pretty much all day in and this one in the, in the living room that she likes to sit in when we're in here. You like that? Good girl. About the only drawer or thing in my dressing room that is organized right now is this drawer. And I always get so many questions about this drawer. I get so many questions about the inserts, but I also get so many questions. Literally my, my direct messages are always like, what earrings are you wearing? So I have told you and I've gone through them before, but I thought I'd go through them again. Just as a little reminder before Christmas, I've partnered up with Astrid and Mew just to remind you of my favorite earrings from their collection. I will link all of the ones that I have in my stack in the description box below. But basically you can order from today and be sure to get your purchases and your earrings and your pieces of jewelry in time for Christmas. So if you're looking to pick anything up, maybe it would be something special for someone that you maybe wanna get some little delicate diamonds for, then you could go for something from the diamond collection, which I wear in my first haul. These are the diamond clickers and I've got the diamond stud in my top ear. Or if you wanted something a little bit more affordable, they have the normal clickers, which I currently have in my ear now. And I have two of those. I've got a rose gold one and I also have a silver one. So I mix it up, I mix and match because I wear lots of different kind of colors of jewelry. And these are perfect maybe for like stocking fillers. It all depends on your budget. So obviously what I say is just that what I would maybe do for my friends. I love getting my friends pieces of jewelry that they can wear and wear and wear and never have to take off. It's always like a little memory of me to them. I got Carrie something for her 30th and I just think jewelry is such a beautiful, timeless gift. It's one of those things that isn't gonna date in your wardrobe either. They become kind of like heirlooms and I just think that is a wonderful, wonderful gift. So I will insert pictures of the items in my current stack and they will be linked in the description box below and just know that you can order today and get your items in time for Christmas. And tomorrow, the 19th of December, will be the very, very last day that you can get your orders in from Astrid and Miu. So if you were thinking of picking anything up, or maybe you were just thinking of treating yourself to some of the items that I love personally, or something that you've seen on there already that you love, there are so many different collections that you can choose from, and I will link some of my favorites down below, like I said. But you've got today and tomorrow to order away. 
They obviously have loads of different styles of jewellery as well. These items are from the diamond collection. Then we've got pearls, we've got little stars, and then the signature studs, which I use just everywhere. They've got little clusters of stars as well, so it's a beautiful little festive gift there. I love these cuffs. These are always sold out. You also don't need a piercing for them, which is perfect. There's also hoops and more of the diamond clickers here and the baguette ones. Oh my God, I love these ones. They're so nice. But as I said, all of them will be linked down below and happy Christmas shopping. I'm not sure if this is too much, but I've got my hair up, so I need something to keep my ears warm. I probably need to get one of the UGG ones that matches my gloves. But we are going out of the boot room area. You would. It's such a snazzy little area, isn't it? I love it. I need to get my, my boots on. Look how muddy my boots are. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Someone has decided she's coming with us. And she's very excited about it. <laughs> This is my first time coming out to see Winky's tree. <laughs> this is where it's planted so that we can see it from the uh, kitchen as it grows. It's a Winky's tree. What are you doing? Come on then. Sometimes she just wants to come on walks with us and there's no stopping her. Come on Fluffy Tail. We're here. Lovey. We're here. Lula. We're here. You are going in the bar when we get home. Come on. Come down to see the flooding out the back here. There's a lake there, but it's all flooded across here as well. It's very soggy, Halle. Hello, soggy moo. Yeah. Yeah, you're the soggiest moo moo. Like the littlest hobo, but loomy version. The soggiest moo moo. I don't mind, babe. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. You were a little bit far away then, weren't you, Fluffy Tail? Weren't you? Yes, you were. Come on then. Muddy bum. Oh no, it's paint, isn't it? <laughs> and now she's sitting pretty in the window. Come on, muddy paws. Be very careful, your paws are very wet. It's very dangerous. Give mummy heart palpitations. So beautiful. Aren't you so beautiful? All that walking has worked up an appetite for us. So we have decided to head to the pub for a pub lunch. We couldn't get a roast, unfortunately, because I think we're a bit late, but doesn't matter. We can still go and have some good pub grub. So that's what we're gonna do. Just a pub that's one that we really like. <sighs> it's cold. It is fresh, heated seats need to be on. On. Heated seats, on. We are going in with the camembert to share. Oh my gosh, it looks so good. I love it. Oh, that was 
just what the doctor ordered. That was so good. Honestly, the plow in Shutlanger, if you ever get the chance to go, it is my most favourite place for a Sunday roast or even just like a Sunday not roast. It's bloody so good. The food is, sorry, I'm going to go dark now, but the food is the best, the best and I just love it, I love going there and everyone's always so nice, they do great gin and tonics. Not that I've had a gin and tonic because I am delicate. But Mr. MG is getting in the car. And we are heading home. Oh, it is cold. We're gonna put the fire on OBS because that is basically our life now and plan Christmas a little bit more. Find yourself a man with a special heated seat on for you. Oh, thank you, babe. This little one is all tired after her walk earlier today. We've had the fire on for ages and we've just been sat here sorting Christmas. Oh my gosh. Wifey beater in the background. <laughs> Look at the state of me, I'm so tired. We have been ordering like Christmas presents or trying to and discussing Christmas stuff. And <sighs> that's my tummy rumbling because I ate gluten. <laughs> oh, there's so much Christmas stuff happening. It's so hot in here. It's so nice in here. Are you awake? You having a stretch? Yes. Yeah. Mm. Is it okay? Is it okay from the hand? <laughs> One more. And then put your hands on your eyes. That's it. Good, thank you. <laughs> this is basically what our evening involves nowadays. We just come and sit in the living room and kiss Lumi. Kiss Lumi basically all night. Look how well she's been positioned. I know, she's such a snuggle fest. I like her. Our friend Matt has said What's it called? Six Underground. Six Underground. Is that gonna be about the people that got stuck in in, in the cave? Ah oh, right. Maybe. Maybe, yes. It's number six and then underground. We watch it tomorrow. He says it's sick. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Should we watch that tomorrow? So, as I've been doing my, what I told you I was going to be doing, I'm burning my candles. So I've got my neon one on just to kind of set the, set the theme in here. This smells so nice. It's like, kind of like a spa aromatherapy kind of candle. I've been planning my Christmas tablescape. I've never done one of these before and some of the items that I've been ordering have arrived. I plan on like setting the table with you and showing you the plan eventually and revealing all of that with you but I need for everything to arrive first. I even managed to get the same, what are they called? Plates. Yeah, oh. what the Cheetah, no, they weren't cheetah plates, they were... Yeah, because I have to say, what is that? Yeah, oh, called? what were they called? No, it's not like Decker plates. No, 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 it'll be on my phone. It's the plates that look like plates, but they're also kind of placemats. And I had them at my wedding, and they've got beads all around the edge, and I managed to find the exact same ones. So I've got those for, for like, table settings and stuff like that, which is so nice, because obviously they're from my wedding, and it's nice to have a little bit of that. Our my, love. my wedding it Our was wedding. me i planned the whole thing yeah. by myself and with a wedding planner and my <laughs> maid you. maid of honor so yeah. it was everyone's wedding <laughs> but yeah so i managed to get those and um we're gonna have those on christmas day and also i found the most gorgeous candlesticks and i think that's what's arrived now so if i unpack those with you you'll kind of get an idea of how things are going to look on christmas day but we're gonna we're gonna set everything together that's the plan that is the plan so i'm gonna go get them so you wait there i'll go get my parcels maybe my lovely husband will be my tripod who bought an oven mitt as a christmas tree decoration it's a mitten it's not an oven mitt it's so cheeky okay oh my gosh this is so heavy Okay, I'm gonna do this first top one because I, I can't get the label off. I don't know what this is. 
Oh, it's Tupperware. <laughs> so this is what Carrie's ordered for. This is Carrie's gift to me. Tupperware. Mm, we actually do need that. We do need Tupperware. So that's good. That's finally arrived. Great. So this, I think, is the candlesticks for the table scape. I think you're going to like these. Okay. These are very Restoration Hardware vibes. Oh yeah, they're nice. Are the little crystal tea lights that I'm going to put all over the table. Mm, they're lovely. I've got those. Not for you, Lummy. And I honestly can't believe that I found these on Amazon. These are so gorgeous, so heavy. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Well, they're lovely. Aren't they? Yeah. And you've got the right dimensions to stick a candle yeah, yeah. stick in. Yeah. yeah. Not candle sticks. So these will be tea lights. <laughs> but they're so heavy. I can't get over how gorgeous they are. These are such a find. So I thought lots of little tea lights in these. How many is there in total? Uh, Six. No, no, no. I got doubles of each size mm -hmm. so that it, I can kind of spread it over the table. Yeah. You're going to go up and down? Yeah. Okay. Nice. Like this. What's it be like? Not like symmetrically like that though. Oh, right. It'll okay. be like scattered. So it won't be like this? No, 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 not like that. Although that looks okay. bloody gorgeous in itself. Okay, so it'd be more like you'd go, you'd, you'd really like play around with it, like, whoa. Scatter them. Oh my God, that has just blown my mind. No, they just wouldn't be in a line like that, babe. I could maybe order more, but there's I've still got some over here. Okay. But yeah, they're so nice. They're lovely. I can't believe, and I think this is our ribbon and stuff for... Oh, for wrapping presents. presents. Yeah, so we decided this year it. to go for recycle, yeah, post paper. It's just brown, brown paper, completely recycled, completely recyclable. Just buy a huge roll of it and do it like that, but then go for nice ribbon. So I found, oh no, this is our sellotape. Exciting. Oh no, and our ribbon. Enough sellotape? Yes. Good. That lasts then a couple of years. we've got black ribbon, obviously, because... The aesthetic is very black. Yes. Um, and then we have ivory ribbon. And then these ivory. are the little name tags to attach with some string. Oh, lovely. That I got for that. Okay. So that's my little Amazon haul. Nice. Do you like the Amazon haul? Yes, Ooh. you do. But that's the thing. So where we live, there is no shop. So having Amazon is a godsend basically mm. because we can get all of the things that we need and Amazon do this really cool thing now where you can order things throughout the week and then have it all delivered on one day okay How, so it's not like co constant like backwards and forwards you can like yeah, yeah. keep ad adding to your list and then everything gets delivered on your chosen Amazon day which I thought was very very good yeah that is quite I didn't know they did that yeah yeah oh. so anyway that's it lovely stuff yeah good for our video. Now, oh no, I forgot to press record. You're such a nerd, <laughs> But now I think we're going to start getting back into a little bit of homeware stuff, aren't we? Because we've got, like I said earlier, we've got the boys in next week, haven't we? We've got furniture mm -hmm. delivery. I'm going to be able to finally reveal the secret project. Dun, dun, dun. Let me know in the comments if you can guess what the secret project is. I don't usually mm. ever do these things, and I don't ever usually hype anything that I'm doing. Basically, I did this for self-preservation so that nobody could judge me and I think it's I think you're gonna really enjoy it But I don't like hyping myself up too much. But yeah, Lovely. So we are gonna get ready for bed now, aren't we? Yep. Have you enjoyed your Sunday, babe? Mmm, it's been nice. We've had such a chilled Sunday, although we definitely drank too much last night. Yes. That was... Outrageous behaviour. Yeah, I don't like drinking that much. S says she who brought 19 shots of Jaeger. I bought 15 shots of Jaeger. <laughs> the difference. <laughs> Listen, every time I've bought shots, it has never backfired on me, okay? It always gets people in the mood. It backfired on me, I've got a headache. Yeah, but that's because you did more than sh one shot. Okay, on your birthday, I got like eight rounds of shots. I spent so much money on your birthday. But... <laughs> but... It's usually good. Yeah. It's usually a good thing to get everyone loosened up. Everyone in... Babe! What? Stop it! Well, I'm just filming you. You're not filming, you're exposing yourself to me on the other side of the camera. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> so yeah, that's my little Amazon haul. There's more stuff ar arriving next week though, because like I said, it's all systems I'll go now. We're very excited for Christmas. Yeah, very excited for Christmas. 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 You've got no idea that you're spending Christmas Day with Mummy and Daddy. I don't think she cares. She cares.